An Australian producer was accidentally included in the Oscars in memoriam segment. Now, the right name was used in the graphic, but unfortunately they used the wrong photo. So an image of Jan Chapman was mistakenly chosen to represent Janet Patterson, the Australian costume designer, BAFTA winner, and four-time Academy Award nominee who died in October of 2016. So here is uh, the graphic in question that they used uh, during the segment. And again, that is the wrong photo. Here is the correct photo of the woman uh, that they should have used, Janet pa uh, Patterson, who's in the middle. N they did work on one movie together. Maybe that's why they. And they were college, They were friends. They were They're, friends yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. So let me read you uh, a quote from Jan Chapman. She was very upset about what happened. She said, I was devastated by the use of my image in place of my great friend and longtime collaborator, Janet Patterson. I had urged her agency to check any photograph which might be used and understand that they were told that the Academy had it covered. I'm alive and well and an active producer. Um, <laughs> the, uh, it's just too bad. It's too bad for the uh, Academy because it, like, it, that mistake which would be excused, or you know, not excused, but understood in a in, in a different year. Now it's the second thing, and yeah. therefore becomes becomes a bigger moment. Yeah, if you thought it was bad that they read uh, read the wrong best picture, they killed the wrong person. <laughs> <laughs> so. I mean, we, we at TCM we do a we do an in memoriam, and it's beautiful, and it's incredibly well produced every year. And I would say it's better than the Academy's. We we are not limited by time, so we can mm -hmm. go a little longer. It's not that long, but it's beautiful. They included my father in, in back in 2000, the one in 2015 for the people who died in 2014. It was beautiful. But you know, this the Academy, they left out, like, I mean, they left, obviously every year you can argue it leaves people out, they left out Robert Vaughn, who was an Oscar nominee and, you know, and, and a significant actor and, and not, a, not a bit player, but a major supporting actor for a long time. It just feels like there's no way they had a conversation where they decided to leave Robert Vaughn off. It seems like they forgot him. But I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, it's just, it's, uh, but every year, look, it's incredibly hard. And, uh, and, and the nitpicking after this show, I mean, it is a live three-hour event that isn't a sporting event. It is and not a debate. Hard to produce. It is hard to produce. That's why Jimmy Kimmel, I just thought, crushed it because it is, it is impossible to get an 100. Like, your best grade is like an 86, and when people get 83s, the critics the next day are like, that ah, Letterman was horrible, horrible. For no, Chris Rock was horrible. Jim, John Stewart was horrible. Jimmy uh, Kimmel did crush it. Yeah, he, he crushed it, and, it, and it's great, and, and, and it's hard to do, and that show kept moving, and it was a really great show, and then it kind of fell apart at the end, but in falling apart, it became greater. But, yeah, you know, another way that Jan Chapman can look at it is, no, Jan Chapman is alive. <laughs> She's alive. Okay. None of the people are named Jane Chapman. <laughs> Jan, isn't it? Jan, Jan Chapman. Chapman. She's alive, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Janet Peterson. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> so look, and then finally on Jan. Look, that's a bad mistake. You do, and and we make mistakes all the time, and yeah. we do live uh, productions. We haven't killed anyone yet. We do live accident. productions every day, though. Yeah. Not once a year, and not with the resources that they have at the Oscars. I mean, I feel like with something like this, just double, triple check with every image and every name that you use. And I, and I get it, it's, so many people died in 2016, so I can understand if they you know, accidentally left someone off or forgot someone, but this takes it to a whole new level. Yeah, I was just surprised that Sting was alive when he did the performance. Yeah. I was like, wait, did see, was that Bowie? No, it's Sting's alive, Bowie's dead. Uh, they almost ran George Michael's picture here instead. And then finally though, to Jan, um, it's okay, don't be devastated. This doesn't actually change whether you're alive or not. It's going to be okay. <laughs> if they put up my picture as, you know, and and who, who uh, and uh, they used a Prince pack, uh, passed away, uh -huh. and then they show my picture. Mm -hmm. I'm like, ah, that's me. <laughs> I'm actually still alive. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be okay. Yeah, yeah. It's going to. It's again. It's going to be okay. I mean, not for Janet. Uh, Peterson, but for yeah. everybody else. Yeah. Yeah, Janet has actually passed away. <laughs> yeah, that's right. But, uh, <laughs> but, but for her friend, the good news is you're still alive. Yeah, and an active <laughs> producer. <laughs> <laughs> that's what she's more worried about. Yeah, that's right. By the way, Jan, believe me, believe me, this is going to help your more career more than anything else. I you can help hire investigative reporters that will chase down stories no one else will. Be the media. TYTnetwork.com slash go.